What's going on guys? Welcome back for another tutorial. Uh, last tutorial I taught you how to make your own Mario hack and how to basically play it, I guess, using Lunar Magic. However, I got a question by... Actually, don't have my channel page open. Alright, here's how to get to my channel page. No, that's not a good tutorial. A good tutorial would be something along the lines of teaching you guys how to pay me with a PayPal account. That would be a really good. No, that's where I got the answer. Uh, you know, I'll use your comment because your comment was on the same video his was. Okay, here, here. Hey, do you have Skype? I need help patching a hack by Blinks Ross. I don't really know who that is, but hey, man, I'll help you. Sure. Uh, I can't really get on Skype. I don't have a Skype account. Uh, unfortunately, I probably should get one. It might help. But in the meanwhile. Because I don't have a laptop or a webcam, I'm just going to teach you how to do one through a tutorial means. So you're going to need three things, and they should be on my desktop right now. This, this, and this. What is this? Lunar IPS, Super Mario World ROM, and a hack. ROM. Well, IPS patch hack of a ROM. So let me teach you how to do that. Basically, you're going to want to go to, of course, supermarioworldcentral.net. Just type it in and you'll get to this page. Then you're going to want to go to Tools. When you go to Tools, search Lunar IPS. That's why I usually use the search bar. Uh, next one. Here, Lunar IPS. Download this. It should appear in your Downloads folder as Lips, I believe. Lunar IPS. L-I-P-S. Right. No. There. That. Once extracted, this is what you're going to get, or the important thing of what you're going to want. To get a Super Mario World ROM, that's easy enough. I explained that last time, but I'll explain it again. I recommend going to CoolROM. Type in this, I guess, if you want to, or just do CoolROM.com, go into ROM search, type in Super Mario World. Go down here, hit the download now. You'll have to wait for a little bit, but it should give you a link and you download it. Once extracted, it should look like this. Finally, one other thing you're going to need is a hack. So for this, you want to go back to supermarioworldcentral.net, go to hacks, and just select one. Uh, however, if you want to make your own hack and turn it into an IPS file, I know how to do that too, but I'll show you this in a second. Okay, so you got these three things. Easy enough. So here's what you're going to want to do. This is really simple. In fact, I just put it all on the desktop. Watch this. Alright, watch carefully now, this might be difficult. Lunar IPS, apply IPS patch. Select IPS file to use. Uh, my hack, so that would be your hack, it should appear. Well, the hack, yeah, the IPS file. Select file to patch. Super Mario World. Done. And that's it. And there you go. I win. That wasn't that hard. So that's how you do that. However, the slightly harder thing you can do, I'll teach you how to do that. Personally, in my download in my documents folder, I recommend making a uh, backup. This is just basically a backup Super Mario World, so I don't have to keep going to download it. So I don't really need this, the hack, so they can go in the garbage. All right. Now, paste that. This is another Super Mario World blank. Alright, so let's say... Stay with me here. I want to make a Lunar IPS patch. How do I do that? Alright, so let's go into... Ross... Scoot on by that. Let's go into Super Mario Ross Night in World 2. Alright, uh, it is... This. Super Mario World Central. Alright, so copy. And, oh yeah, I should probably rename that. Uh, copy. Uh, this is probably going to ask me to rename it, isn't it? Yeah, I can't do that. Alright, so I'll copy it right here. Uh, well, let me copy it right there either. Well, Alright, so go over here. Okay, it should let me copy it here. Paste. Okay, rename, and I'll make this Ross9890 World 2. There you go. And you just drag this on the desktop. I guess if you want to. Uh, I still have a backup. Okay, I do, I do, I do. Good, 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 good. Okay, here's what you do. 
Lunar IPS. Create IPS batch. Select original unmodified file to use. So you're going to want to go to Super Mario World Center, the, just the regular Super Mario World. Okay. Select new modified file to use. Ross Nano World 2. Select IPS file to save as uh, Ross Nano World 2. And the IPS batch was successfully created. And there you go. Now, one last thing I want to do is demonstrate this. Grab this. Apply IPS patch. Ross 989 World 2. Go down. Super Mario World. And it's batched. And now, if you were to play this. Load. Play. And you get this piece of crap. That is how you use patching. Uh, how you submit to SuperMarvelCentral.net, if that's the question you're asking, I would not know. But that's the basic gist of how you do it. Hopefully, this helped. Should be the solution you're looking for. And, uh, I'm looking at this, and I just really, really hope that he's sending me a hack. That would be awesome if he was. So if you are, that's awesome. If you aren't, I don't really care. Just use this forever you need it. I uh, hope I helped, and, uh, see ya.